welcome back to another video and today we're doing a review on a all new release from Broadway Limited Imports and this is the N scale Paragon 4 with Rolling Thunder Union Pacific Big Boy as you can see it comes in this pretty standard packaging from Broadway for their N scale products uh, which is a hard clear uh, plastic box uh, which is pretty good for protection and then on the inside as you can see we have it stated as a premium N scale locomotive and then there's the logoing there from Broadway and yeah there's a clear window there but you can't see the model uh, as of yet uh, so looking at the sticker as you can see it's a bit small there um, but it states Union Pacific Big Boy number 4014 and we have this in the Promontory Excursion version uh, so there you go um, there's not much t else I don't think on the box so we won't waste any more time and just simply open it up slide that off quite easily flip this cardboard piece and there you go we have some accessories straight away um, this model comes with not only that it is a new model uh, from Broadway but it also comes with a new feature for N scale that is and that it has a uh, smoke fluid uh, which has, which of course is a smoke feature, uh, which is something that we're very excited to see. Uh, but accessory-wise, we have a pipette here uh, to put in uh, to, to use the smoke fluid and insert it into smokestacks. And then, other than that, we have, I believe, yes, a cover for the smokestacks. Bit hard to see, but yeah, you can simply put that over the top if you so wish and then finally we have a extra coupler knucklehead coupler um, if you want to install that on the front of the locomotive so we will flip this and there you go now we have the extremely uh, beautiful model it's quite long um, obviously this is a duplex locomotive so kind of have to assume that it is a large locomotive um, and it comes in this nice shiny gloss um, so it is a bit hard to see at the moment so we will go ahead and take this out and have a closer look as you can see we've removed the big boy from the packaging and taken off all the foam inserts uh, along with any of the film uh, but just before we take a closer look at it additionally there was this accessory which is a decal and I'm not too sure what it is, but I would believe that it is that small chalk um, signature of the word Big Boy, uh, which you can install on the front of the boiler. Um, other than that, at the bottom of the box, we had this functions sheet uh, from 0 to 28. And yeah, all the Paragon 4 functions that you can use for this model uh, uh, right there. So... Uh, one other thing is we have this little sheet here which tells you how to use um, the locomotive in DC or DCC and on the flip side you have some very important uh, information about the functional smoke unit and it has some specific instructions on how to uh, use that. Uh, so we will be using that soon uh, so we can demonstrate how good this uh, smoke unit is. But other than that, um, just looking at the locomotive, the lighting is a bit poor at the moment, especially since it is a nice glossy black, so it's a bit hard to pick up on the details. Uh, but we will try our best uh, for you to get a good look. Um, so, yeah, running into it, this is a fully die-cast model, so it has quite a bit of heft to it. Um, there's lots of separately applied details like railings, piping, um, lots of um, molded detail like your rivets. Um, when looking at the locomotive there doesn't seem to be anything that's missing or damaged and the paint seems to be perfectly well done uh, so that's always a massive plus and yeah other than that there is of course the one knucklehead coupler at the rear of the locomotive and then on the front there is uh, nothing obviously because they gave us that extra coupler if you so wish to install it and picking up the locomotive, like I said, it's got quite a bit of heft for for especially being a N-scale locomotive. 
Um, but yeah, as you can see, the lettering there and the numbering, 4014. Um, everything's nice and crisp and clear. Union Pacific on the tender there. Um, there is a, I believe, a permanent joint here, so I don't think you can easily remove um, the connection between the tender and boiler. The cab is detailed on the inside, uh, but there are no crew members or firemen. Um, not that you would really need that, considering how small N scale is. Uh, but yeah, lots of detail, uh, rivets, piping, railings, all the sort. Everything you should expect um, in this day and age. Then looking at the top, at the smokestacks there, as you can see, there is the entrance for the smoke unit, and I believe the whistle also has, uh, just under the whistle, there's also a small hole there uh, for some additional smoke. Then on the front we have the number boards, brass bell, headlight, uh, but yeah, apologies for the poor lighting, it is quite hard to see, especially since this locomotive is such a dark colour. Um, and yeah, obviously this is a duplex model. Um, and it is extremely long and yeah we are extremely excited to see how this runs we've had uh, Atherns and scale big boy and we were pretty happy with that but we do believe Broadway uh, presents a bit more quality uh, so we do have pretty high expectations for this model um, so I don't think we'll waste any further time and get it straight onto the tracks and see how it operates So to wrap up our review of Broadway Limited's new big boy release in N-Scale, uh, overall this is a fantastic model, um, just looking at it, it is very well detailed, uh, it runs exceptionally well and the quality of the material is also uh, really good, um, especially for N-Scale, quite small but everything looks really really well done. Um, in comparison to Athern's uh, N-Scale big boy, I would recommend this one purely because it runs that little bit better, uh, but both are good options. 
Um, but yeah, Broadway's done a really good job with this and we're excited to see what else they have in store for the future. Uh, when it comes to the smoke feature, it is... It's not the best. Um, I certainly think the technology needs a bit of time uh, to really get there and make it one of those things that can, you know, like in HO scale, be something that you come to expect. Um, and yeah, it, it is, yeah, it needs its time and I'm sure eventually we will get it. Uh, but it is cool to see that they can fit them in models of this size now. Um, so yeah, all, all praise to that. So overall, great model. Um, certainly recommend it if you are interested in this. Uh, we will certainly feature it in some future videos or just running around the layout. Uh, but until then, thanks for watching. Uh, subscribe if you're new and any recommendations or comments uh, are welcomed. And we'll see you in the next one. Thank you for